Akshay Kumar. If my film flops on Friday, I will get over it by Sunday night. The real action hero of Beaton talks about his new movie Boss and admits how crazy stunts drive him wild even now. In an exclusive chat with the film trade expert Komal Natha on ETC on Bollywood Business. Hi, my name is George and Jacob. You're watching Bollywood Life. Akshay Kumar has come a long way in Bollywood. After doing a series of Kaladi movies in which he showed off his action chops, Aki worked in emotional dramas like Wak, The Race Against Time, Andaz, Etras, and many others to prove that he has more to him than his just leaps and bounds. But this Eid, he is back to his favorite genre with Anthony D'Souza, Boss, that hit the screens across India and overseas today. Does the project look promising to him? I believe in the talent and ability of Anthony D'Souza, asserted Akshay in a candid chat with film trade analyst Komal Nada on ETC Bollywood Business. One wonders, how does Aki agree to do mindless action flicks such as Blue Witch Tank at the box office? Do stunts alone seduce the 46-year-old to sign on the dotted line? The Kiladi Kumar said that he agreed to do it as soon as he heard that he would be shooting underwater and doing crazy stunts. What is the basic premise of Boss and is there something to it beyond the obvious action masala we see so clearly in the promos? Akshay explained that the emotional core of Boss is a father-son relationship. In Bollywood, there has never been a song specially dedicated to fathers and there's the first one to do that is in Boss. In a career spanning over 20 years, Akshay has seen highs and lows. How does he deal with a mixed bag? The superstar said that if this film flops on Friday, he'll get over it by Sunday night. He doesn't force producers to pay him exorbitant amounts. Click here to know why is Deepika Padukone feeling homesick. And click here to know if Deepika Padukone out Sonam Kapoor from Homi Ajanias next. And do not forget to subscribe for the latest B-Town Gossip.